What's up, guys? If you are into music reaction channels that are honest, raw, and authentic, look no further. You found your destination. It is the Taz and Philly Show. Welcome to our journey. And make sure that you subscribe below and enjoy the show. <laughs> What is good, you sexy son of a gun? It's Philly. It's Taz. It's the Taz and Philly show, and we are back with another reaction video. Hello, everyone. It is Philly and Taz. We are back with another Ren reaction video. Uh, these are always fun for him and I, and we hope for you guys as well as uh, Ren has never disappointed, really. Uh, maybe a couple of times we have had a difference of opinions out of the fucking 3,000 songs we've listened to, but <laughs> I love pretty much everything he's done, and I am uh, excited to hear this because I, I haven't yet, and I don't know if anybody uh, tuning into the channel may have. Or maybe some of you have, so you can let us know what your opinion of it was, but it's going to be Money Game Part 3. Uh, it's an official music video, so we'll see a little bit of whatever this is. And um, definitely looking forward to it because, as we know, if you've been following the Ren journey, then you know that this shit could go all over the spectrum. So um, I have no idea what we're getting. So let's uh, – I guess we'll wait and see. Taz, feel free to give your thoughts and we can get on into it. Yeah, just really quick. Um, <clears throat> Philly and I want to both say thank you. We just reached over 13,000 subscribers, a.k.a. Fantastics. Thank you guys so, so much. Awesome. Absolutely thank awesome. You. Yes, we haven't even been here a year yet. Our anniversary isn't until January 12th next year. So this is not what we expected. We, we took a chance. This was Philly's dream child or whatever the hell you call it. This was his idea to start the reaction channel. He asked me. I said yes. yes. So um, it's always great joy when my best friend is able to record with me. Um, but on times that I record alone is always for the both of us. He knows this. It's always Taz and Philly. No questions asked. So without further ado, oh, I'm sorry. What I always like to say, and this is this goes to always, we represent music appreciation on this channel. Please, please, please make sure that you subscribe to the artist that we react to and like and comment. Um, if you look right here, I'm scrolling up. We already subscribed to Ren a billion years ago, but I'm going to like this song because I haven't heard it yet, but um, it's supporting. So we practice what we preach. So please do the same. Ask yourself if this was you, wouldn't you like to wake up the next day and say, oh, somebody liked my song, somebody subscribed. So we represent that. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, also make sure that you always check our pinned comments and our community tab. You never know what's going to be there. It could be a contest. It could be some motivational stuff. It could be something funny. It could be asking a suggestion from you. Right now, we're asking what benefits and features you would like in a Patreon page because we want to cater it to your needs. What would make you join a Patreon for reaction channels? So please tell us in the comments below. As Philly always says, you control the narrative. So start controlling it. Um, now, without further ado, let's check out Ren Money Game Part 3. Neither one of us have seen it yet, so we were waiting for this moment to do it together. So here we go. the Beethoven. I know, I'm impressed. On a mask, oh wow. Stays true. He's doing that blind, he can't see. Stevie Wonder, you get a blind. Good point.
the mask off. One years old and his first words were mine, mine, gimme. Two years old he was walking, three years old walking quickly. Four years old he was running round the pavements of his city. Five years old and his daddy told him, listen here son, you gotta learn to be a man. A man he works for what he wants. Six years old and he's reading writing, top of the bunch. And when he's seven, his progression made him student number one. Eight years old and he's praised for unusual grades. Nine, his parents paid for private school to nurture the flame. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, he ascends and ascends. His daddy tells him, son, money is the means to all ends. Fourteen, solving complex mathematic equations. At fifteen, IQ 150, still elevated. 16, he develops complex software code that detects weaknesses in cybersecurity protocols. 17, and he sells his vision, keeping the share. Not yet an adult, but he's practically a millionaire. 18, and his daddy tells him, Now you're a man. This world don't give a damn. Pull down deposits. 21, his income rockets. 20. If you manipulate the data, then the lie will sell itself. 23, a life of luxury, crystal and cocaine. 24, he makes the Forbes list, they're applauding his name. 25, and his daddy tells him, listen here son, while you're sitting in that palace, that don't mean that you won. 26, a business shift, he switches business to arms. He's 27, dealing nuclear and shells in Iran. 28, inside the Senate, money bought him a seat. He's 29, a role of counsel in the president's suite. Now we Three. His daddy says you're losing the race You're just a servant to the king Not even in second place 31 a big manoeuvre for his daddy's approval Moving imports over borders from the exports out of Cuba 32 moving grams growing kilos to tons He's 33 filling warehouses with powder and guns 34 turf war with nobody to stop it Blind eye from the popo inside of his pocket Wow. 35. He gets the call. I'm sorry, son. But it's your father. Had a heart attack. I'm sorry, he's gone. 36. Getting pissed off. Abusing his product. 37. Eyes glazed. This position demonic. 38. With a prostitute. A moment of passion. Heating up a silver spoon and then chasing the dragon. 39. Getting breathless and hungry for power. Daddy's words are still driving him to kill and devour. Makes a move against the cartel, but the strategy's flawed. They retaliate and leave him in a hospital ward. A bullet buried in his vertebra and one in his leg. The doctor sighs and says, I don't think you'll be walking again. Fuck. Wow, what a changeover. Wow. Let me tell you a story about a boy named Jimmy. He was 40 and he cursed the words, mine, mine, gimme. 41, he wasn't walking. 42, not walking quickly. 43, never running round the pavements of his city. 44, inside a palace with a mountain of gold. But those riches turn to rubble when perspective evolves. Weighing heavy on his conscience is the value of gold. Lamborghini for a life, trading money for souls. Jimmy followed the code inside the land of the free. Put your hand inside the cookie jar, take more than you need. And his example is exaggerated versions of me. And it's a version of him. And it's a version of she. And it's a version of you. There's no escaping the blame. The way we live is parasitic. Fuck the money and fame. Cut the music.
This isn't entertainment. This is real life. The way we live is lunacy. Community it declines. Hyperpolarized, always fighting, then we divide. Truth is less important than the money that we designed. Money's an invention. Politics from our invention. They all come from people's ideas. Did I mention? Borders an invention. Law and order fuel the tension. It leads to people killing each other. My solution. Everything is subject to change. We could build utopias if individuals were taught to use their brains. But if we teach kids in schools to always be sheep and put themselves before the herd if there's more money for me, then there's no future I see where the humans survive with parasites inside a petri dish with cannibal minds. Mold will grow upon the surface and consumes till it dies. And our fate could be the same without this story to the wise. Forty-five. Jimmy comes home out of the rain, soaking wet upon a wheelchair, drinking the game. He is everything he wants, he is fortune and fame. He's a fortunate fool with an unfortunate fate. With a 45 caliber aimed at his brain. 45 a fitting number, cause his age is the same. Here's the words of his father. It's such a damn shame. Then he presses on the trigger of a money game. Oh my God. And that's wow. Oh wow. Well, well. He very <laughs> uh God. Go he's ahead. A true, you no, know, he's he's just a very he's a true artist, man. He's kinda He's he's cerebral. He's ge he's just genius. Like just the, the there's really not a lot of people out there that come up with things like that. And just the way he's able to storytell and switch it up, and it's just I don't know. He's got a very interesting perspective. I I I I really think he's quite amazing with the way he's able to to do that. So just a tremendous storyteller. Kind of uh that was wild, man. Really captivating. Yeah, and like the journey that he took you on, I mean, by, by mentioning the age, the progression, and then at that young age to have it instilled in your mind, you know, you have to learn how to be a man. Like, you know, um, because there is no rule book on how to be anybody. I mean, yeah, you can learn trades and stuff. There's books for that and schools for that, but like, <clears throat> excuse me, but like to learn how to be a man, <clears throat> you know, there's no rule book for that. Just like there's no rule book to be like a parent. Um, but then later on in the song, he was talking about, like, I don't remember the exact words, but like learn to be he and learn to be she. So like, it makes me think like, you know, this song is related and about everybody, not just men, just everybody in general. Definitely. You know, um our existence to to learn and but it shouldn't be like his father had instilled in him like you have to learn how to be a man you have to learn how to take you have to learn how to give me like if he started off at three or four where he sounded like greedy and stuff like gimme 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 now of course you know little kids they say that about toys and stuff like that but if that's instilled with you when you get into like adult years and you're still with that gimme 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 mentality that's not a good thing. I mean, that could corrupt you. That could make you have everything skewed, you know. And then sometimes it could it could spoil the rest of the batch, you know, just like that proverbial um, or actual p bad apple in the bunch that makes all the other apples bad. Like if you're surrounded by people who have this negativity of gimme, 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 power, 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 this, this, that, 
it can bleed into people who may have like dare to say weaker minds where they think that that's okay and then it just messes up things and then look where it took him to the end where he was in a wheelchair and then he, he had a gun to his head i mean all from the beginning stages of having something instilled in your head of to be a man so this is a very powerful song about like society and how we view things and how we interpret things and how we think like they were better than or we deserve more we all deserve more but it's a matter of how you get it like you shouldn't like rob peter and kill paul or whatever that saying is to get it or whatever like that the power of minds if people work together for a greater good but in harmony and without backstabbing we can accomplish a lot but it's just too many people that are all segregated all over the world and people think they're better than this and better than that or or they were raised a certain way that was not necessarily the right way and it just mm. can mess up and travel into your future existence that shit was deep philly um and it it felt to me like that was like one take because like yeah, the camera like that, huh? yeah the camera never really veered off of him so like it blows my mind how he he remembered all that because this wasn't like a rap per se it was a rap but then it was also singing and then it was also like a speech it was like a mini a mini movie it actually made me think of rest in paradise Michael Jackson. I used to get so excited back in the day when Michael Jackson, they said this Friday at the world premiere of Michael Jackson and like everybody would get ready and he would have some video that's like 16 minutes long. Why are you laughing, Philly? Why are you laughing? Nah, I'm not. Just everything's, <laughs> you compare everything to Michael Jackson. No, for that, for, no, for the, for the, for the setup, for the excitement of knowing that a video is coming of his, and then it'd be like this mini movie. Michael Jackson would have some videos that were like little mini movies. And that's yeah, what Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what Rand did. This was like a little mini movie. Sure. You knew it was coming, you know, but mm -hmm. we waited, of course. I mean, we always want to watch him when he first premieres his sh shows, but Rand especially is one of those performers that I like to wait for Philly for us to do it together. So we waited, and I'm glad we did wait because this isn't something that really I can watch by myself and then convey it to Philly and vice versa. It's good that we got to experience this together. So this was deep as shit. It's something to think about. I can't get over the fact that he's such a young person, but he has such the maturity of like some grown ass human. Um, he's just so wise beyond his years. So it's just amazing. So anything else you want to say? Like, wow. No, I'm ready to vote. That was uh, spectacular, frankly. Can't wait to see what other people think. Can't wait to see yeah. what people decide to tell me that was terrible. But, hey, I'm sure that's coming, too. <laughs> but, uh, hey, anyway, so it's uh, time to vote. This is ass or pass. And what do we do here? Well, it's thumbs up, thumbs down. Pretty simple. You can figure it out. If the song's ass, then it sucked. Thumbs down. If the song's not ass, thumbs up. Pretty simple. Taz will count to three. I will drum roll, and then we will rate it together. Taz, are you ready? Yes, you are. Let's fucking go. Three, two, one. Boom, boom, boom. We got two yes. hands. <laughs> I got two hands because it was worth two hands. That's why it was worth two thumbs up. It was so fucking good. All right. He got me there. Yeah. Awesome there sauce. Go. All right. So, uh, yes, uh, thank you so much to Ren for putting out another masterpiece, and I'm sure we'll be continuing down that journey as more and more music drops. And uh, <laughs> thank you guys so much for being here, and we'll be back soon with some more reaction videos. Uh, again, I am Philly. That is Taz. It is the Taz and Philly show. Have a wonderful night. Peace. And take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>